on, this way. Wait. What? Where are the others? I'm not sure. But I think they're dead already. Now, come on. We gotta keep moving. We have to get out of here. Okay. Come on. We're on. Daisy? Daisy, come on. Where are you? Daisy, please. Come on. Is anyone there? No, please, don't hurt me. I put a spell on you. Mr. Williams. Uh, hello, Principal Allen. May I ask what you are doing? Uh, well, I was just on my way to class, sir. On your skateboard, I see. Uh, <laughs> uh, yeah, funny story, actually. Uh, you see, since I don't want to be late to my history class, because, you know, I just you know, it's really important for me to learn more about history. I thought that maybe riding my skateboard to class would save me more time. And that way, I would get a head start. And you know, I would start getting out all my material. You know what, Andrew? Yes, sir? I really like your school spirit. And I really like that you want to learn. So that's why I'm going to give you this note right here so you can come after school for an hour or so so you can learn more about history. That way, you won't have to worry about getting late to class and you'll be ahead of the lesson and of your other peers. Oh, <laughs> no, you don't need to. It's perfectly fine. Why, of course I need to. Here you go, Andrew. Detention, Mr. Williams, for one full hour. Ugh. But it's Halloween! I'm quite aware, Mr. Williams. I'm quite aware. Ugh. Oh I just gosh, love your, your new like so Oh, and look at that. G. <laughs> Thank you, thank you. Miss Wilkinson. Oh, why, hello, Principal Allen. I see you have bought new clothes. <gasps> why, yes, I have. I'm very glad you noticed. My necklace I got from Tiffany & Co. And my very adorable skirt that you see is actually from the very popular store, Polyster. How extraordinary! Why don't you tell me more, Miss Wilkinson, about your new wardrobe after school in detention? Oh, Mr. Allen, you see, I love to, but I actually have very important plans today after school. I need to get ready for this uh, Halloween party, and I really just don't have time. <laughs> Sorry. Detention, Miss Wilkinson. No excuses. And you three. I'll see you in my office to talk about your detention schedule for this week. Yes, yes sir. sir. But Principal Allen, we didn't do anything wrong. Ruby, skipping class to talk about your new wardrobe isn't actually considered a good thing. Have a nice day, ladies. <laughs> Mr. Olson, what do you think you are doing? 
I'm expressing myself, Alan. Isn't that a bit obvious? That is Principal Alan to you, sir. And that is Liam to you, sir. Don't you get smart with me, young man. No one ever said I was being smart, Alan. Detention, Mr. Olsen. After school for one hour. Ugh, I'm crushed. You better be there. Whatever you say, Alan. Oh, Romeo, Romeo. Where art thou, Romeo? Oh, such a Oh, gosh. Miss Wells, what are you reading? William Shakespeare's Romeo and Juliet, sir. Well, what a wonderful book, Miss Wells. It's a shame that this isn't the time nor place to be reading books. And I'm pretty aware that many people do not read books in the janitor's closet. I'm sorry, but I'm going to have to give you detention for an hour after school. I understand, sir. Now, please get back to class. Right away, sir. Uh, you're putting us in the attic? Yes, I am. Why? Because there is nowhere else to leave you. How about a classroom? Nope. Why not? Because I'm the principal and I said so. Ugh. Now, whether you like it or not, you're all going to stay here for an hour. Oh, come on, sir. Let us go. It's Halloween. Andrew, you are 17 years old. What are you going to do? Go out trick-or-treating in your Superman costume with your little friends? <laughs> oh, no, it's actually an Iron Man costume. For your information, well, the hour starts now. Oh, by the way, I heard the school was haunted, especially this attic, and especially on this day. But you all could use a little scare. Have a good day. Ugh, there's nowhere to sit in this place. Then sit on the floor. Uh, but it's dusty. Then clean it up. Oh, whatever. Uh, he was lying, right? About this place being haunted and stuff? Of course he was. Actually, he wasn't. Wait, what? This place is haunted. I know because a friend who used to come to the school told me all about it. Oh, please. This place isn't haunted. No, it is. It all happened in... Sorry, that was me. <laughs> uh, anyways, like I was saying, it happened 18 years ago, in the year 1995. This attic used to be the art class back then, and there were four kids in detention, just like us. One was a football player, the other one was a nerd, one girl was the most popular girl in the school, and the other was just, well, you know, usual. I'm not really sure how they died, it's kind of, well... It doesn't really make sense. Why do you say it doesn't make sense? Well, I don't know. Because one by one, they just started dying. I think someone or something was killing them. But I'm not sure. The nerd guy died suddenly. And then everyone started going crazy asking why did he die? So they all tried to escape, but they died before they could. So something was killing them. Well, I guess so. Oh, I don't believe you. I don't think that there's anything in here trying to kill people. Fine, don't believe me. I'm just telling the story. Oh great, it's raining outside. Ugh. Just like the day they all died. Oh, come on, let's stop talking about that. Fine. Wait, what's that? What's what? There. 
It's like a door, I think. Oh, a secret door. Let's not go through it. Yep, it's a door. Uh, let's go check out what it is. Wait, are you really gonna go? Well, yeah. Do you really think that's a good idea? Oh, come on, you scaredy cats. Go on, open the door. Okay. Wait, Liam, let's think this through. I mean, come on, do you really want to die? Oh, we're not going to die. <gasps> oh, no, that's not a good sign. Well, I'm going in. Hold up. This is so not a good idea. Uh, I'll stay here. You know, to see if anything- Andrew, come on! Oh, I can't believe you guys are making me do this. Ugh, it rots in here. It literally smells like someone died. Well, I guess we should go back. Ugh, don't be such a wimp. Come on. We'll go upstairs. Where's the light switch? Over here. Oh, much better. time for us to leave. Good idea. <gasps> Guys, hold on. I... What are you kids doing here? I think the question here is, what are you doing here? Yeah, Principal Allen. What are you doing here? Well, I heard a sound. And I wanted to know where it was coming from. Oh, really? Wh hold up. It's him. He's the one who's been killing everyone. Wait, what? I didn't kill anybody. Are you sure? Of course I'm sure. You don't sound so sure anymore. Okay, I think it's time for us to leave. You kids aren't going anywhere. Now it's time for me to have a little fun. No, please, don't kill us. We didn't do anything. Don't do it. We didn't don't do anything to you. Don't kill us. You four have been some very, very bad 